lost in locks. This is all completely true. <laughs> you muster the hitcher pole and struggle to free the older bowl, washed downstream and wedged in the lock gates, until, distracted by a boater, you allow the pole to sink and sink. And now, as the water wavers, you gaze down, recalling the hoe you lost last week at Cleve, imagining a trail of lost garden implements. But it's not only them. Gerard's glasses went in last week at Benson, and yesterday, early, before the boaters arrived, you stood indicating the spot where his rower's camera was last sighted the previous evening, while Roe Ray, keeper at Osney, flung his magnet on a line again and again, but nothing ever came up. One day, all of this, the river's collective unconscious, might lie in museum shells, like the Roman sword dredged all those years ago at Shifford, now behind glass, immaculate in the Ashmolean. As for Windsor Old Weir, it's seen no salmon these past two decades, but that hot summer when river levels were low, a motorbike was glimpsed. And best of all was when they drained Penton Hook and at the bottom found waiting, lopsided in the mud, a piano. Completely true. <laughs>